Your future is a hidden treasure map, and your guardian angels are excited to share clues about the adventure that awaits. Think of how, sometimes, our emotions can feel like a tangled jungle, especially when worry or shyness creeps in. It's like when shadows grow longer and it seems the only path is down into the depths. Have the angels ever whispered secrets to you? Imagine standing by the sea, looking out into its endless mystery, feeling a storm of emotions swirl inside. Our hearts are like the ocean, sometimes calm and clear, other times wild and stormy. Picture how confusing it feels when you're not sure what someone else is thinking or feeling. It's like being lost at sea on a raft, with giant waves of doubt crashing over you. Ever felt caught in your own emotional storm, not knowing which way to turn? Life throws us into these tests, much like the ocean tests ships in a storm. The signals we send to others, without even meaning to, might be rocking someone else's boat. But here's a hopeful thought, just like boats are made to sail through storms, our hearts can navigate through these emotional waves. What do we do when our inner compass seems to spin in circles? There's someone out there trying to figure out how they feel about you because they can't tell how you feel about them. They want to be your lighthouse, but they're getting mixed signals. Sending mixed signals without realizing it is something many of us do, especially if we don't know someone has caught feelings. When we're just being ourselves comfortable and relaxed, others might read more into our actions than we intend. So think about it, can we learn to sail these emotional seas together, guiding each other to the treasure of understanding and connection? Show your support by giving super thanks up to $20. Someone in a swirling tornado of hope, fear, excitement, and so many what ifs. They keep replaying every single moment with you, like a movie, trying to pick up on any little hint that you might like them back. Ever been there? Trying to crack a code in every smile, every word, hoping for even a tiny sign that they feel the same. Think about this, they say our eyes are like windows to what's inside us. Next time you're hanging out with this person, try to really look at them. You might just catch a glimpse of what they're feeling. Maybe even see a bit of your own feelings staring back at you. What's your gut feeling about this? Have you been missing their signals or have you just been caught up in your own stuff? Right now, this person is standing on the edge, wanting to tell you how they feel but scared to take the step. They're tangled up in nerves and worries, and it's something your guardian angels are trying to point out to you. Picture it, someone's trying to figure out their feelings for you, but they get mixed up because sometimes you're open and other times you're closed off. It's not really a problem you need to fix, but it's a big lesson. Everyone, including this person, wants to know for sure, to get that clear sign that tells them it's okay to go ahead. Imagine them at a crossroads trying to decide should they jump in and take a chance or pull back to where it's safe. Can you feel what that's like? Remember a time when you had to make a big choice, not knowing what would happen next. That nervous flutter, that moment of hesitation before stepping forward, it's something we all go through. Understanding this can help clear up the confusion, bringing you both closer to understanding each other better. Every choice we make is like picking a path in a huge, twisty forest. Sometimes, we wish we had a big arrow in the sky pointing us the right way, right? Now, think about this, you might not know it, but you could be someone's arrow, helping them find their way. The things you do, the things you say, and even the times you're super quiet, you're a big part of their adventure. It's pretty amazing when you stop and think about how much we can affect each other's paths, how one person's journey can help shape where another person ends up. 
Let's picture someone sailing a boat in a big, scary storm. You might guess they're most afraid of the stormy sea around them, but there's something even trickier. The biggest test isn't the waves outside, it's keeping the sea from filling up the boat. Here's a cool thought from your guardian angels. Imagine the sailor, heart thumping, hands all shaky, staring out at the stormy sea, big waves coming at them. Can you imagine how heavy that feels, trying to keep everyone safe, steering through wild waters? It's more than just fighting the storm. You can see it's about not letting the storm inside the boat get the best of you. It's like being in a dance-off between worry and willpower, fear and bravery. Imagine a sailor in the dark night, searching for the light of a lighthouse to guide them home. Maybe it's a nice word from a friend, a hug, or just someone being there when things get rough. Have you ever been like a lighthouse for someone else, giving them a little bit of light in their darkness? Or maybe someone has been that light for you. It's pretty cool to think that even when we feel all alone with our troubles, we're actually not. But here's the thing, the only time negativity and worries really drag us down is when we let them. It's like if a boat starts to fill up with water. If you don't do anything about it, that boat's going to sink. By focusing on scooping out the water that is, kicking out those worries, rumors, and fears, you make sure your boat stays floating. Isn't it wild how much what we think and feel can change everything for us? Ever noticed how just someone's words, even if they're just rumors, can totally mess with your mood? Handling these waves of emotions and thoughts is key. It's like navigating a ship in a big storm. You need some skill, a bit of guts, and sometimes a helping hand from those around us to keep moving forward. Remember how it feels when someone says something mean, or when a rumor feels like a backpack full of rocks. But here's a cool twist what you do next, how you react, that's where your superpower is. You've got this amazing ability to ignore the bad stuff and focus on what really matters. Have you ever stopped for a sec and realized how tough you are? Your inner muscle is pretty awesome. You're way tougher and smarter than you might think. It's like you're sailing through a stormy sea, but you manage to steer clear of the big, scary whirlpools. How cool is that? It's super important to remember how much you've grown and not worry about all the little things. You can't make everyone happy, and that's okay. This includes the person who's biting their nails, wanting to tell you how they feel but gets tangled up in all the what-ifs. Now, let's chat about something neat the lighthouse. Think of it as your lucky charm, showing you the way to safe places. The lighthouse is there to help you out when you're feeling lost. Here's a little trick. Close your eyes, take a big breath, and listen to that little voice inside you. That's your intuition, kind of like your secret hotline to the universe, telling you which way to go. The lighthouse is like a strong base for all the good luck coming your way. If you ever see a lighthouse while you're out and about, or even see a picture of one online, Take it as a sign. It's the universe's way of giving you a high five, reminding you to trust that little voice inside, guiding you through the rough and smooth parts of life. Spotting a lighthouse might just be a hint that something really good is about to happen. If you're wondering whether that certain someone will open up about their feelings, hang in there. They're going through a bit of a tug of war inside, but they'll find their way to sharing, just like the heart of this message says. Try not to worry about all the noise around you instead. Focus on getting rid of any bad vibes that sneak into your life, kind of like keeping water out of a boat. Let's close with a hopeful note, hey there. We're sending a shout out to those feeling a bit lost in their feelings, looking for some clear signs. We hope you find the strength to figure things out and the guts to say how you feel when it feels right. 
May your inner voice be like a flashlight in the dark, guiding you to a place where you understand each other better. Wishing you the toughness to keep going and the smarts to focus on what's really important. Amen. And a little nudge from your guardian angels before we go, you've got more awesome in you than you might think. Trust in what you can do. And remember, the universe has got your back. Tap in 444 to hold on to this message and the good stuff it brings. Why not spread some cheer in the comments for others who might need a boost? Your kindness can start a wave of good vibes that comes right back to you. Let's help each other feel great and share the love. And hey, there's a chance there's a picture out there that kind of captures the vibe of your soulmate. Maybe it's someone you know, or maybe not yet. These pictures have a way of surprising you with their spot on vibes. Curious? Take a peek, you might be amazed at what you find. There's always a new message or hint out there for you. Are you ready to listen? Show your support by giving super thanks up to $20.